Okay, so I haven't done anything yet with my uh, power steering hoses. Those are still waiting to be put in up here. And I've got a bad uh, hub seal down here that's dripping grease, and I'm sure the rear end or the, the front differential needs filling. And I need to work on that. But uh, something else that I started working on here is my taillights. I uh, had some taillights that weren't working very well. And considering the state of these uh, bulb sockets, it's not surprising. But uh, both the lenses were shot, compromised. So I picked up a couple of new tail light lenses and it was like you know really cheap for for this so you know we're uh, good to go there now the other thing was because those tail light sockets were so shot and I replaced them, but what do you replace them with? You know, these don't even have any flanges left on them at all. Well, I went grubbing around in the spare parts bin, and many years ago I parted out an 80, 1982 Nissan Maxima, and uh, this is an 85 Dodge, and it just turns out that the bulb sockets for the 82 Maxima are just about a perfect replication here and they go in There's one way they fit and they turn right in there and the only problem is they're exposed to the weather on the back and if we look at the bed here it's all wide open to the weather so I just get myself a little RTV silicone here. I had blue and ran out so I got some black and uh, fill up all the holes on the back. So they are now weather tight. They got this nice cushy little rubber gasket there. So two extras. I've got my brake tail here and my back up here. So those are good to be put back in and uh, wired back up. But my wire connector selection is woefully inadequate. And uh, along with my screw selection, I got uh, some pretty poor looking screws here. I'm going to have to, let's see, i got the one, two, I've got the four things there. I think over here, though, I've got one, two, three, and a, no, oh, they're all four there. Good. Okay. So I need to get some wire connectors. But in the meantime, I'm going to move back up to this front grease seal here. See what I can do with that. The action cam screwed up, so you didn't get to see all my removal of the cap and the adapter ring and the lock nut and all that with my special tool, or the taking of the back brake backing plate off. According to the book, this part right here is supposed to come apart from this part right here. I'm not seeing it, but <laughs> that's okay. We'll we'll get there. Uh, they say I need to take this off, though. So let's see if I can find a socket that'll fit that. <sighs> what do we got here? Something like this, three quarter. That looks like a nice round number to try. It's bigger than three quarter, even. Next up on the list is one of those two. Not 
that one. That's too big. And that one looks like the one to use. Try. Oh, let's turn this so I can get access to it at the back. How about that? And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just leave this key off the ring for now. Leave it in the ignition. No battery in in it, so. but not quite, huh? <laughs> wonder if we get my caliper move slightly there out of the way. Oh, that shock absorber is just not cooperating. Goodness for impact tools. That's all I gotta say there. This has to come off somehow. Somehow, some way. I'm just not sure where the heck that's supposed to take place. if there's a gasket on that. And yeah, it is a separate piece there.
Man, I really don't want to bang on that. I mean, I really don't want to bang on that. Or these. that on there just to protect it, huh? What they used for gasket in there. Huh. Can't get the uh, upper and lower. Pivots. Well, folks, I almost feel like it's uh, YouTube time. Let's see what other people have done here. That's a floating piece right there. So center on that. If I could pull away on that with a puller. bottom
pushing on that pretty hard. This whole steering knuckle is kind of... Hmm. Well, what do you think? I see progress! I see progress! Come on. Come on, you can do it. This is a good thing. Ta-da! Beautiful! Ha-ha-ha-ha! <laughs> I beat you! I beat you! I beat you! Now you come out. Oh, you beautiful thing. And 
there, in there, is the seal that I need to replace. Okay. So, if we look in here, you can actually see the seal that I need to replace. But I can get to it now. <laughs>